Welcome to Bunex Investment Group. In this video, we are going to talk about how to trade with a $100 account. We'll go through everything we need to know pertaining the trading technique. But before we go through, make sure you subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so. And check the notification bell icon so that you won't miss any of our videos as we upload. So in this video, we're going to explain this in four parts. We are going to start by defining the $100 account, the $100 account trading instruments that you need to focus on, then $100 to $10,000 journey. Then last but not least, which is very much important, is the $100 trading strategy. And we'll actually do this on real markets or actually the real charts. So make sure you stick up to the end so that you will be able to be fully equipped on how to actually trade with this small account. So before we start, I need to make it clear. Someone would say trading such a small account is senseless. You need to join uh, a funded a prop firm and so forth. But this model can also be applied to any account size. So moreover, the living expenses differs from uh, with where you are from in the world because if we look at the living expenses in most african countries is actually very very low that someone can actually live off a 250 dollar account actually 250 or 300 dollars per week or even per month so of course 100 dollars is a very small account but with proper risk control and determination it can be grown into a bigger account so someone has a question that I'm going to deposit a hundred dollar account is this going to change my life the biggest thing that should be noted is we need time to grow this account so as to avoid blowing it so you we are going to of course I would say uh, or give a spoiler alert that that hundred dollar account is definitely going to rise only if you give yourself time and practice proper risk control and have determination by determination i encompass having the rightful trading mindset the rightful trading psychology and the vision to actually see your account being something bigger you can actually do it so what instruments do we trade on a small account so i've come across several traders who says i am a gbp usd empire or a NAS 100 King or a US 30 Master. I'm here to tell you that everything of that sort is rubbish. These are high volatile assets that require some room to play out. If you buy NAS 100 and put a very tight, tight loss, you are likely going to be taken out before the market goes your rightful direction. So I would say, giving that room on a small account, if we widen the stop loss to the rightful amount, a hundred uh, uh, dollar account will only result in blowing it. You actually be someone who is keeping on donating money to the broker because if they see you depositing a hundred dollar account, they actually classify you as book B trader. And that is another topic for another day. Therefore, it is wise to actually avoid exotics like USD, Mexican peso, USD, Russian ruble, um, USD against South African rand, and so forth. You need to avoid exotics, uh, indices, metals, that is uh, um, gold against US or gold against Euro, anything that has metals as well as commodities, that is wheat, uh, coffee, maize, and so forth, when trading with this small account, which is a $100 account. So focus on the majors and minors. That is uh, the basic Euro USD, USD card, um, USD CHF, and so forth. And these can allow you to properly cal calculate your risk and your targets. So on these majors, it's actually easier even to count pips unlike on USD against Mexican peso or USD against Russian ruble. So here's the most uh, important thing and uh, probably the most awaited uh, topic, which is the journey of taking a $100 account to a $10,000 account. So I would say this is not easy. You need to be highly, highly determined for you to achieve this. And compounding is the biggest secret. And whoever takes it seriously moves the world at will. So it doesn't mean that 
you are going to be a good trader if you are going to trade with a 1 million account what you do on this hundred dollar account is the same things that you are going to do even on a six figure seven figure account so firstly you will not make this flip hundred dollar to ten thousand overnight or a month or even six months or sometimes even a year unless you have gambled i know that some people would say i can spin hundred dollar account to a ten thousand dollar account I once did it but if you done it it was pure gambling and it was once in a blue moon so if we are to give you another hundred dollar account to do the exact same things you will definitely fail and by by that would say uh, flipping hundred dollar account into a very large amount of uh, money within a small period of time is actually something that I call gambling however by allowing compounding to work for you you can easily flip this account to ten thousand uh, guaranteed so compounding is more like a snowball right if we start with a small ball and roll it down a year you would see that as we go this snowball starts to accumulate snow and as it goes it becomes bigger so we started with a small snowball and it actually got bigger so with each revolution it makes it acquires more snow until it becomes big such that it accumulates more snow so you start with the hundred dollar account it goes to 400 400 goes to 800 800 goes to 2000 2000 goes to 4000 and so forth and at those amounts of money probably at 4000 5000 you now have the power to open uh, substantial lot sizes that will allow you to accumulate more funds easily so next is the compounding technique you may use to reach 10000 so a 100 dollar account is actually difficult to trade with the risk technique actually the fixed risk technique therefore the load alteration technique is employed by fixed risk technique we are saying if you say i am going to risk two percent right or i'm going to risk one percent of my account on a hundred dollar account it's going to be close to impossible why because two percent of hundred dollars is two dollars or ten uh, one percent is actually um ten dollars or actually one dollar and 0 0.5 is going to be 50 cents so you cannot um get a trade that allows you to only risk 50 cents otherwise the spread will be actually uh more than that so we use the lot alteration by that we mean for whatever um for whatever stop loss it's going to be 30 40 pips we are going to use a 0 0.01 for a hundred dollar account so whilst we are still at hundred dollars we are going to be focusing on using 0 0.01 and at 200 0 0.02 300 0 0.03 uh, 400 0 0.04 500 and so forth so we're basically taking the first number for our account size putting it at this point so at 1k which is 1000 it will be 0 0.1 right so 0 0.1 will be the lot size for a $1,000 account so with this we can see that as we are rising in our account balance our lot size is also gradually rising and that is all that also means our potential profit will be actually rising as well so doing this for six eight 12 months 18 months 22 months you'd see that you will be actually approaching the ten thousand dollar journey someone may ask when will i get the ten thousand dollars i would say that now depends on the market conditions we only trade when the market offers us a point of entry or offers us on an opportunity we do not create entries but the market gives us entries and it's wise to focus only on the high probability entries and i'll actually review that in the next uh, strategy so for a small account like this it is wise to make intraday trades right 
focusing on intraday trades if we focus on swing trades swing trades have the ability or can actually chop and needs more room for them to breathe so on this channel we use the market maker strategy it's actually the institutional simplified institutional market maker strategy which you can as well learn so it's a very powerful strategy and once mastered you can get uh, you it's actually a very powerful strategy once mastered so you can get a simplified course from us and it's actually going for 99 dollars, and it will definitely help you as well i'll be available for questions if you find any part difficult so this will allow you to focus on intraday uh, entries like pins to the water or safety trades so in this particular hundred dollar strategy i'm just going to show you a very simple technique of finding entries in the markets with consistency and with discipline so let's see this on the charts so basically this is a very small uh, a very simple strategy and i do not say be confined on this particular strategy only but actually you can uh, as well uh, incorporate it in your trading so basically what we'll be doing is to look for proper m's and w's and we we'll actually employ two emas actually three the 13 ema applied to close the 50 applied to close and the 200 applied to close all of them are exponential moving averages so in this case we are only looking for a crossover after a crossover we need to see an m around the 200 ema region like this so our entry will be on the second leg and the second leg can actually you can actually wait to see a candle closing below the 13 or you can actually jump right into the market after you see a candlestick reversal pattern that has been issued so in this case it was an example of a proper entry and stop loss should always be above the high of day or low of day we had an entry like that then after that we could wait this was a day another day came then a 13 a 50 200 crossed and from there we had a w like this which gave us an entry point right we have two trades in our bag that have gone in our direction right in this case we can see we had a crossover a crossover but in this case this crossover was the one that made a flow and a w was issued from there the market went our way then we had another crossover and our setup a, another type of m that was issued and the market went our way as you could see that we actually started our 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 our, our back test from the from this point it was one two three four trades so far that are in our site so basically if you see something that can hold for over 150 trades uh giving you proper entries as well as proper flow you would actually deem that particular strategy uh very accurate and you can apply it on your real accounts so in this case we can see that this is working out but it will be foolish of us to think that we may we are not going to lose so that let's increase our lot sizes the moment we increase our lot size that is when something bad happens in this case we had this m that occurred and it went our direction right we had we now had five entries going into our direction at this point then it comes or oh, the market issues us this kind of an m we had a crossover as we anticipate and after that crossover we actually saw first leg second leg and we went short after going short this happens it means the market actually went against us our strategy failed at this point so imagine after having these five entries going in your direction and you find only one that goes against you like this like this whilst you were now over risking or actually not following the lot alteration technique you actually there is a high uh, high possibility to wipe out all the profits that you had before 
right so from there the market came back and gave us what we had lost at this point so it was around seven trades seven winning trades and one losing trade so basically that is what you'll be doing is just an example and i'm not confining anyone to follow this particular strategy this is just a small strategy to help you actually cut about yourself and it's not uh, everything from our course our course actually gives proper points of market entry and to get it please don't hesitate to contact us using the comment section on that on that note we come to the end of this video and i would like to thank you for watching this video up to this point on that uh, have a good day